Christmas, everyone. On behalf of the Tabernacle Choir and Orchestra at Temple Square, welcome. Get in the holiday spirit with the beloved Tabernacle Choir at Temple Square. You just heard some of their upcoming concert, and today we're talking with film and TV actor Neil McDonough, who will narrate the 19th annual holiday concert, Oh Holy Night, Christmas with the Tabernacle Choir. Neil, it's so good to have you on Good Things Utah here in Salt Lake City. Are you excited to be part of this? Ron Gunnell, first of all, I'm sure everyone there in Salt Lake knows who Ron is. What he does is just... You know, here's, here's a guy who, who, by all rights, should be retiring, but instead he does all this stuff, you know, for 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 nothing because he loves it and he knows it's the right thing to do. And when he asked me to, to be part of it and said, well, here's what we're going to do. We're going to bridge the Irish Catholic faith, faith with the Latter-day Saints faith and make an, an amazing show with Irish music and talk about your Irish traditions and our traditions and bring it all together and make it one great show. I thought that was just the greatest idea. And, and for me to be, you know, a Catholic and, and you know, my Irish traditions are huge. Both my parents are from Ireland, growing up in Boston, all the extended family that was always around, all the Irishness that was everywhere. Uh, it, it was great. And to be on stage right there in Salt Lake with the massive orchestra and the choir and all the fans that were there that night. Uh, but most importantly, to talk about my relationship with God, my, my Irish faith right in front of my wife, Ravan, our five kids in the front row was you know, one of the top five nights of my life. And, and I mean that from the bottom of my heart. I can't tell you how much I appreciated what everyone in Salt Lake did for my family and how they took care of us and, and really treated us like family. And in our house, it's family first, me second. And that's what we celebrated on Oh Holy Night. We talked about Jesus' family. And when he came, you know, with nothing, and, you, know, you know, in a manger with, with, with just family and building his life upon family and not just his family, but his holy family. So for us to be able to, to, to create a show and make a show and for me to be part of a show that talks about the Holy Family and then how, how we need to remember that during the Christmas season and how important that is, not the presence. You know, like I say with the Irish, it's not what's on the table, it's what's around the table. And that's what's most important. Family first, me second. And, and that's what Oh Holy Night's all about. And I'm just so proud of it. Oh, I like that. It's not what's on the table, it's what's around the table. Can you describe what it was like, the power of those voices? If you had my mother's cooking, you'd understand why. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. So it's definitely not about the food. Got it. Okay. When you are there and <laughs> you hear the <laughs> you hear the combination of those voices all together, can you describe that experience? No, you you, you couldn't. You know, it was during rehearsals. It was the the biggest challenge for me. You know, I've been on stage a gazillion times. I've been in tons of movies and TV shows. I've been blessed, blessed, blessed to have the life that I have. But this was one of those times when even during rehearsal, I, I, I couldn't stop choking up because it was so emotional for me to talk about all traditions that my late mom and dad would, would, would talk about or instill into me and that I instill with Rebe into our kids and those traditions. And then to hear those songs that I heard as a kid being sung by Megan Hilty behind me, it was, it was just, and, and to see that massive choir, you know, the 500 people who, who do it all for no money, but for love of God and love of their craft and, and knowing that God gave everyone in that room an artistic craft that, that was really good and solid and we celebrate it and embrace it. Man, it's one of those nights that it's just, it's electric. And you could tell by the people that were there that night that everyone knew that something special was really happening on stage. And, and I was so blessed to be part of it. I want to remind everybody how incredible Neil is, everyone. Award-winning actor. He's been in over 100 movies. Captain America, the first Avenger, Forever Strong, Greater. He's starred in major TV dramas. My favorite, Desperate Housewives. Loved you in that. Tell me how your skills as an actor, so how your skills, like, when it comes to being part of this event, like, what did you use to make sure it was nice and smooth with the choir? Confidence. It was all confidence because, you know, when you get up on stage and, and all of that is behind you and you come in as a, a kind of like the pinch hitter, you know, everything's kind of been worked out. And as soon as Megan and I landed, it was the show was running with or without us. The show was running. So we had to catch up really fast. So thank goodness for all the years of being in front of cameras on stage that that confidence was right there. And, you know, also my wife, Reve, is is my is my greatest, you know, you know, positive thinking coach and everything and you know her talking me through it and saying you got this honey and it was it was it was really it was 
just incredible. It was really incredible. Oh, you had your biggest fan there. That is important. When and where can people watch the show? Uh, on the 18th on BYU TV is uh, it's streaming, so you can get it for free. Uh, I'll just say this: it's it's a show that you don't want to miss. And and you know, I don't really say that very often, but all the things that I do, the look of the whole thing, it just feels so Christmassy and. and you know, the voices and the outfits and, and the stories. And, and it, it was just one of those really magical evenings that, you know, you, you feel like you're in the in front of a fireplace listening to Irish stories. And, and, and it was it was it was it was pretty spectacular. I'm Welcome in the holiday season, everybody, by watching Oh Holy Night Christmas with the Tabernacle Choir and actor Neil McDonough joining us on Good Things Utah today. Thank you so much. When you're in town next, please stop by the show. Neil, take care.